Please listen to this. Faith cannot deliver. Faith only fertilizes. Welcome and enjoy the teaching. The mystery of the praise altar. And we quickly look at part three of it. And I want you to be very much alive. Something is dropping for you this time. The altar of praise is the altar of supernatural manifestations. God shows up in the midst of praise in your favor. But this is how it works. Acts chapter 3 and verse 6. The man at the beautiful gate Fix his eyes on Peter, expecting to receive something. Expecting to receive something. Ask chapter 3, verse 5. Expecting to receive something. Expecting to receive something. Now, please listen to this. Faith cannot deliver what is not expected. Because faith only fertilizes what is hoped for. Hebrews 11, 1. Now faith. Is the substance of things hoped for, the evidence of things not seen. So, what faith does is to convert your expectation to manifestation. So, where there is no expectation, faith is impotent, it has nothing to fertilize. To manifestation. Therefore, in this last segment of prayer, because I will leave you to praise God by yourself. I'll leave you to praise God by yourself. The way it touches you. They will play their music and you will display your madness before the Lord yourself. So there won't be anybody, the, the people leading praise, who are not singing the song I wanted to sing. Now sing your own. There is nothing they play I can't sing to. If I'm not tuning to their sing, their music, I can tune to my own. It's so important for you to know that what you expect is what determines what you experience, what you expect. People praise God as if it's a means of warming God up. God does it in the warm up. It's a consuming fire. Do you warm fire up? You are not warming God up. It's you that is cold that needs to warm up. Warm up to God. God doesn't need your warming up. He said, the Lord thy God is a consuming fire. You don't warm up fire. He dwells in the midst of the pillars of fire. Don't you read the book of Revelation? You can warm him up with what? Expecting. Somebody is going to dance into a miracle marriage here. <laughs> Somebody will dance to their miracle children here. <laughs> Somebody in this service is going to return home with quadruplets. <laughs> for, because for his shame of many years, God will visit him with four to trouble the devil. <laughs> now, you, you understand what I'm saying? Somebody is going to walk into a miracle job now. Amen. <laughs> They will call him this Saturday. Amen. I said, the job is waiting for you. Now, expecting to receive something. Now, now, the Bible said, surely there is an end. Proverbs 23, verse 18. And thy expectation shall not be cut off. Let the sick say, the end has come. 
the end. This is the end. Yes. I've prayed for it in the 21-day fasting and prayer. Now, this is the end. Now, now. now, now, this is the end. This is the end now. Don't you know that when anybody is going through trouble, they say, except God. Now, this is how God steps in. Okay, so where's the end? Now. So let the paralyzed know it is now. Now. Let the one carrying terminal disease know it is what? Now. now. Let the one being afflicted know it is what? Now. Surely there is an end. Proverbs 23 verse 18. And thy expectation. That means at your end. Expectation is what will deliver it. The result will be delivered by your expectation. The result will be delivered by your expectation. Paul and Silas praised the Lord. And God came in. There. Then. Not the following week. There and then. Expectant praise. Expectant praise is the key to your supernatural encounters on the altar of praise. Expectant praise. Expectant praise. Expectant praise. Let the one carrying any growth on her body know that surely there is an end. An end. And the end is now. For now is the accepted time. And today is the day of salvation. Now! Now! That pain will disappear. Now! That goiter will dissolve. Now! That tumor will disappear. Now! The reason why we don't get answers in prayers is that our prayers are just mere religious empathies. God, you see what I'm going through? In case you are not saying it, let me tell you what I'm going through. Things are very bad. It's so horrible that people are even asking me, where is my God? Eh? God, where are you now? He said, keep asking. When you are tired, let me know. I won't tell you where I am. It's in this book. <laughs> Go and find out. I mean, people pray without expectation. They just pray to enjoy more pity from God. God, see me. I'm your child. Oh. I born again proper. I feel Holy Ghost. <laughs> he said, well done. I fast 21 days. I've never eaten. So that can be an harassment to me. Please be expectant. Something is about to happen to someone here. Be expectant. Somebody's watching here from somewhere. Something is about happening in your life. Be expectant. Be expectant. Don't dance empty dance. Be pregnant with expectation. You are about to deliver the miracle you have been longing for all your life. Amen. Can I hear you loud and say amen? Amen. Praise brought Lazarus out of the grave. What are you doing there? Abba. Hmm. What are you doing there? Praise your way out of the grave. You don't belong there. Praise your way out of the pit where there is no water. You don't belong there. Please praise with expectation. Stop dozing. Eh? You don't doze before a judge. Stop dozing. Have you ever seen them waking up a lawyer that... You are in court. No, 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 no. How many expectant here tonight? Now, let me tell you something that will happen. Among the supernatural manifestations in praise is supernatural promotions. Supernatural what? Say, so yet I will rejoice in the Lord. Then the Lord will make my feet like hinds feet and will make me to walk upon my high places. Everybody here is changing level supernaturally. Yeah. Habakkuk chapter 3 verse 17 to 19. Everybody here is changing level supernaturally. Now, let, let me say this. I don't want any of my sons here to mention poverty again. It's not a good word. There are no poor people in this church. You only have rich people who can get richer. Amen. It's not part of our vocabulary. There's no poverty here. Amen. Amen. I hated the word poverty even when I had no money. Poverty is a bad word. It keeps people down. 
Don't use it. I want you to be, just be expectant for a change of story. How many are expectant? Yes. I said, you are changing level this morning. Amen. The new week you are entering into is going to be the most humorous week of your life. Amen. They will send for you like Joseph and bring you out of the prison to the palace. <laughs> Depending on how rigorously you praise him and how madly you are expectant. Be expectant of a dramatic change of story. I know. That's the way it works. I don't care what the doctor said about you. What God says is final. Yes. Say with me, God has the final say. Say it loud. God has the final say. My God has the final say. My God has the final say. I'm not moved by what I hear. I'm not moved by what I see. I'm only moved by the word of God. Hallelujah. I'm only moved by the word of God. Hallelujah. Everybody sing. Amen. 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 Everybody sing, amen, 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 sing in amen, 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 amen. Never forget, faith cannot deliver what is not expected. Remember, faith can only fertilize what is hoped for. Remember, it is your expectation that faith converts to a manifestation. So expect anything here this morning. Amen. I want you to expect, among other things, the fertilization of your intellect. It is a shame for anybody to mistake you for a dummy because you have the mind of Christ capacity to be a co-creator with God you have you have the mind of Christ when I saw that I knew I mustn't limit myself to the human realm in my conceptualizations no no it makes me think outside the natural box. I can't stay there. You have the mind. Ah, the mind of Christ. And as you press him, he said the hand of the Lord came upon Elisha. His hand will come upon you tonight. I mean, your understanding will open up. Most crises we have in homes, in businesses, they are all results of inadequate wisdom. Inadequate wisdom. When his wisdom flows freely, his ways are ways of pleasantness and all our paths are peace. <laughs> Academic excellence becomes a natural sequence. You are not struggling to make it happen. You are given a God-ordained capacity to assimilate and discharge. How many are expecting the hand of God upon their life this hour? Please be expectant. We are not warming God up. We are connecting with our inheritance. That's what praise is all about. Expectant praise is the gateway to the manifestations on the praise altar. That's how you get it. Expectant praise. I've told you this before. Somebody had a fire accident in the kitchen and had bones all over her body and came to our praise service. And someone appeared to him and said, rise up and embrace me. 
And as she rose up to embrace the invisible guest, all the effect of the fire disappeared. Everything that is negative will disappear from your life now. Yeah. The same way that woman carried a set of twins who had been, who had a verdict of will never have a child. That same way someone is carrying miracle children from here. Amen. Whatever is unwanted in your life, the hand of God will reach out to you tonight and clear it off once and for all. Expectant praise is the key to your access to supernatural manifestations on the praise altar. I'd like us to rise up to our feet. Are you ready? Rise up to your feet. God is only committed to your expectations. Whatever you don't expect, you are not entitled to experience. Whatever you don't expect, you are not entitled to experience. Whatever you don't expect, you are not entitled to experience. Whatever you don't expect, you are not entitled to experience. Expect a turnaround touch tonight that will deliver total health to your body, bring you into realms of supernatural promotions, and release upon your life supernatural blessings. Now, whatever way you can make it happen is left to you. I like musicians to please get on the instruments and then start with words and move into singing and worshiping God and celebrating God in a dance. The dance of your song, the dance of your own. And let's see what God does. I want you to close your eyes if you need to and let nobody distract your attention. Let nobody snore it, snore you away. Leave him, leave him. Leave him and just face your own business. You are you and God this hour. I want you to dance a dance of expectation. Sing songs of expectation. Hallelujah. And make movements of expectations. I want to see the hand of God on my life. What happens when you praise him is that he manifests his hand. He places his hand on you and opens you up to a new world. I'm going on to a new world tonight. Glory to God. Somebody expect that tonight? Lift up your two hands and thank him for your things. Whatever those things are like. Arish. Glory to God. Yes, shagaraba yakatakara radam. Yes, shiga gagaga gagado sa. Eris konoto brekelia ye shagalaga. Galakarato selia. Woo! Glory to God. Zezuzuri, Zezuzuri, Egobala, Yeko Tuzane, Adu Barade, Zizagalakata, Eriya, Yaketo, Baradize, Elo Shangalo, Bradiya Kalatoze, Elopo Ropo Loko Tozelia, Hirosa Sazaza. Hallelujah. Just celebrate your God the way you like. Hello, brethren. Thank you for watching this video. Please don't forget to like this video. That is, if only this video has blessed you, like it. I believe from this teaching, we now know how to attract signs and wonders. It is now up to you to choose a praise you are going to use and dance before the Lord. As you dance, your miracle and your breakthrough shall be on the rhine. Remain ever blessed.